Hello everybody, welcome back to City Skylines. My name is Ben Pope and this is... Let's turn on the actual play. We're looking at the hospital uh, here, the Grand Jews, European style hospital, and it's the city of Thinkofen. I believe I pronounced that correctly. If I don't, I apologize. I know that it's not really a city in real life, it's more like a village. Uh, but the name was suggested to me from one of you guys, one of the viewers. And I said, you know what, we're going to make this sort of, um, we're going to create this grandiose city under this name, although it's not a city in real life. So let's, um, let's not be in first person mode anymore. And let's just go into sort of the, sort of the, um, uh, cinematic camera mode and look at a couple of spots where we have. European style housing, uh, and we're gonna have to actually look. I, I believe because of the space available, they didn't, you know, they didn't make any like one by one house of that style, so that's why this sort of other house is there. Um, and it's random, not all of them will look like this. Um, of course, some of them look really cool, other ones look like they haven't been refinished and they need to be, you know, re uh, retextures and no, not not retextured but like the stock was all old, you know what I mean? Like 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 they're from old back in the day. We have a lot of nice uh, views. Like this guy can you know sort of see the water with those crazy windmills there. Uh, I don't know why you would put this table, picnic table like that on the on the cliff. Uh, but my garbage is piling up today. We're gonna we're gonna fix some things today. Um, I I can't I can't wait until seven thousand five hundred population so we can so we can get incinerator plants, uh, and until then we're gonna have to put down more um, yeah this this never worked <laughs> uh, the um, yeah my bad okay so from here we can pull power across. And we have to give them water. Poor people at the uh, recycling center just don't have any water. And of course, that's not a that's not a huge big deal, but it is. It is because we need people to actually be able to. Um, you know, make it. And I, I realize I say actually a lot when I just say actually, actually this, actually that. Hopefully you guys don't find that too annoying. And today we are going to try to get level 5 housing. And we're also going to move all that industry from there. Uh, because it's not very cool. So, um, we're gonna... Yeah, let's do let's do a road like this. Uh, in fact, I want to be able to. Hmm. I want to be able to go like on the edge here. Not gonna let me do it. Go far in and just sort of outline this oil industry area as much as I can because that's going to be important. Want to have we want to have oil industry all up in here. Just fill it up with oil with oil industry. I'm gonna do this really quick. I'm just gonna make a grid. Uh, with roads. Not leave any of the, um, the squares out. Like that. And 
we will need an exit and entrance here as well. But let's let's put in oil industry. Okay, I want to draw the district first. All right. So we're gonna have uh, it apparently chestnut district. Um, we're gonna have this called. Go away, dude. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm spelling it. Okay, fin, think of fin, think of fin, think of fin. Oil Co. So the Thinkpin Oil Company, it's gonna get, it's gonna be crazy. Uh, we're gonna have to have him recycle because otherwise, too much trash. We'll give him smoke detectors, and um, I don't know. I don't think we have to limit their power consumption and stuff, but we'll we'll figure that out. We'll figure that out. And right now we don't need says we don't need much oil or uh, sorry industry but we're gonna put this in and um, what's gonna happen is we're gonna just remove the old industry area we have so so it makes sense yeah all right so this we're just gonna on zone people are gonna go nuts but you know what you guys can just build over there and and do oil sounds good yeah are you mad are you oh. i suppose i'm gonna be mad in a second because <laughs> that breaks up my power connection Um, let's do no can't do it all right well that's it's probably okay we have to make sure that is okay and we have to make sure that you have connection all right let's uh, unpause and uh, see the madness unfold it's it's saying we need more uh, residential and I agree this can probably use a uh, road and it looks like I have to destroy somebody's house while doing this but maybe not maybe we can just Maybe we can just do it without destroying any houses. Um, in fact, let's try that again. Yeah, that's probably good. Um, I don't want it too drastic of a turn. Of course, I say that and then I go and do this. So, kind of tells you what sort of mayor I would be. Uh, and since these guys, I suppose, are here. Don't worry about it. It looks messy, but you know what? It's totally fine. I know you're probably like scratching your head or I, what else could people be doing? They could be um, screaming at the monitor screen, um, all sorts of stuff like that. Of course we also have farmland and I don't like what happened here. This is supposed to be an orchard company so they have fields and stuff. I think I'm gonna demolish these to hopefully get them to build something else. Uh, because although we can see, you know, like th this is kind of what it was trying to be up there. But 
if they don't build a building, it will just look stupid. So. Okay, let's get. Uh, let's get this district. Um, we need a name for this district. And I don't know what it's gonna be. But we're gonna draw out the district. Possibly. Oh I made a mess there, but I'll fix it. Possibly all the way out to here. It'll be one district. Uh, just so I can give them policies and so on. Uh, apparently, power grids are not connected. Really? Oh, I'm just running it low on power. Right. Well, I could do could do some of these. Give me eight hundred. Uh, give me eight megawatts. These over here give me twelve. So let's do another one of those. Maybe is there better than twelve? Twelve should be fine. We have plenty of money. I I don't think we should be shying away from building uh, as much stuff as needed. Uh, water we're fine with. Probably won't run out for a while. Okay, so what I want to do to boost this, all of this to hopefully uh, five star housing, is I need to put in public transport, and we do have buses. So we're gonna put a bus depot down, hopefully not too far away. I think I'll put it next to next to this um, sort of a central area. So bus depot there. And then we need to put in bus lines. Um, so we're just gonna go with the old pink thing, the old pink thing. That's what I call this area. And we're gonna start. Oh, I don't know. I think we'll have to have a, a line at the hospital, and we'll have to we'll have to have it go. So we're gonna add a spot, a uh, park, uh, <laughs> a stop. Add a stop there. Add a stop there. And we are gonna hop over and go. Just go down this road. A couple of. Like that. Over here. Um. Where we come out this way, next to the schools, and then let's go. Let's go here. Um, I suppose. Can I, I can unclick it? Okay, so we want to get back. Yeah, it's okay. So, we'll add a stop here, we will add a stop here, uh, over on this side, and then complete the line. Okay, uh, and then... What can I do with it? I can... I can probably... I can probably rename it or whatnot, but I'm not gonna worry about that right now. The idea is that we heard all that dinging and all that donging, uh, which should have upgraded some houses. Hopefully... Oh, they're on the way to 5 star because of the bus and let's go let's go to traffic we have traffic there okay so the bus line 
Uh, has five vehicles. Hmm. Let's change the color of it uh, to maybe a darker blue. Sweet. Okay, so it has 13 spots. Um, color tourists. I think I'm missing something. I think I was supposed to be able to edit, or maybe later on. I don't know. Maybe I needed mod to edit the number of vehicles and so on. Uh, but yeah, so that's gonna be. Uh, Old Thinkafin, Thinkafin. I'm I'm gonna eventually get the pronunciation correctly. Um, and let's call it Express, because it's a bus, and it goes really fast. So people will be able to take the bus now and go to the hospital. We're gonna make we're gonna make more lines. In fact, I need to make a line right here. Uh, before too long, you know. Fine, I'll I'll put another set of these down. Those are not not going to give me the best um, reward for for like how much power they they create, but that's okay. We want this to be. Let's let's make this whole thing. Yeah, let's make this whole thing just residential. Why not? It will hopefully build up some high-level housing is right away, and maybe get like a nice row house s style going on where these are on an angle so they don't look as good. Alright. Um, these people are crying about land value. What was I going to do? Yes, I was going to put on the bus line the uh, Thinkofin farms, uh, the northern farms. They are actually probably protesting right now inside that they need to um, get to the hospital as well and they just they just can't. Because, um, yeah, they just, for some reason, uh, they, they want to stop at the, at the shopping center as well. And, um, the shopping center. And then they, they want to be able to get, you know, into the city from their farm area. Um, we're going to have to go back. So, add more stops on this side. Add stop here. Uh, we're gonna, yeah, let's add a stop right at the end there. Um, and then sort of go through the farm land which hasn't even been built yet but um, let's see how can we do this we can we can do this a couple of different ways and we're gonna do it where we go in this way and add a stop add a stop Then come out this way, because we want to we want to come back on the highway. Uh, in fact, we want we don't want to go back on the highway. We want to come back this way. Stop here, and then end over here. Uh, let's end it. Hey.
sweet. Oh, let us finish it. Okay. Let us finish it. Cool. Alright, so that's going to be another stop. Or, I should say another bus line. And, uh... Yeah. And we're going to call this... Northern Farms. Northern Farms. Um, that's it. Just Northern Farms. I couldn't figure out another another, na another name uh, besides just using Express again. And, you know, we don't want to use the same name twice. Or oh, that would be kind of repetitive. So there's going to be a lot of buses r r roaming around. I have, um, stop it, I have downloaded a few bus mods, so there's like different colors of buses, well there'll be different colors depending on the line it they take, uh, but there's also different uh, looking buses, like this is a Mercedes, Mercedes bus, see the one in front of us, and uh, let's go a little faster, oh jeez, so under the tunnel, again, it doesn't look good. Because the game is not um, does not know about the first person view uh, being a thing, so we're gonna take a ride through our farms area, the northern farms of Finkafin. As soon as this bus uh, gets to get there, it's it's now there, and it's probably gonna stop. I like how it's doing this sort of indentation in the in the road to where the bus stop is see it, it pulls over it doesn't actually stop in the middle of the lane so it gets to turn around in that tiny spot uh, but don't you worry about that it's fine so fantastic we're gonna we're just gonna ride the bus for a couple of minutes uh, but looks like it only traveled 30% of its line so far so it's gonna take a while. We're gonna um, probably gonna not worry about it for a while. Yeah. Of course, this is um, this is something we can change. We change its color because the northern farms probably should have something green, green or or like. Uh, a yellow for like ripe, you know, wheat. Yeah. Done. So now the buses should be of that color. Where are the buses? There they are. Very cool. Now, do we get. Did we get any. Level 5 houses? Not yet. Uh, oh my god, okay. <laughs> this whole time I was like, yay me, and I never even, never even did this. Never even connected the power. So our oil industry is now gonna get going, thankfully. Uh, let's put in entrances and exits here because I also forgot to do that this is a simple one that okay how about like that there we go a simple clover leaf which is isn't it's just a simple Simple exit and entrance for this. Okay. Luckily, we got some bus lines in. We were hoping to see the next level of houses, but I guess it takes a little bit. They're not just gonna uh, do that. They might need a second uh, transport, maybe higher land value. 
you know, something like that. Maybe I can put a park over here. Small plaza? No. Uh, I need like two by twos. City relax area. Maybe I can get something that's longer. The mini labyrinth is big, isn't it? No, it's not. Not big at all. You know, let's do the mini labyrinth. I haven't seen one. Cool. So that's gonna give these people plenty of um, things to do in this area. We will, of course, give him some uh, extra trees to fill in the gaps. And, you know, people are going to wake up in the morning and go, Oh my goodness, there's a tree in front of my house. But that's, that's how it is. He's lucky he can drive right in his, in his uh, house if he wants to. He can, like, have a garage right there. Cool, you guys. Um, we are kind of out of time for this episode. But we will come back. Don't you worry. Let's maybe get let's maybe get a view over here. I kinda think I kinda think this would be nice. The hospital and the two houses. And why not? Uh, ended on a high note not that there was a low note maybe it was a bit boring but I hope you enjoyed it do come back for the next episode where we hopefully will have five level level five houses um, hit the like button and share this out with your friends I appreciate you watching my uh, content and I noticed that more people like watching the uh, city skylines European city on my channel than a lot of other things I upload so I'm gonna keep making these hopefully make one and upload every day make one a day so I'll try to do that and if you guys keep watching I keep making them again I'll see you next time bye